pays besides being just a great graffiti writer you know definitely had a nice little hand style definitely did the train era real good um i think he's one of the first artists that kind of you know he had his own clothing line you know he pretty much was real big in japan he had his own store had a lot of products and then besides that as the reason why he's my inspiration is bigger than the graffiti stuff is he was one of the first art directors at def Jam. So he did like the logo for the DC Boys. I think he did the logo for. Uh, I think he actually did the Death Jam logo, the uh, Public Enemy logo, a few EPMD joints. You know, sometimes you hear the name and people just live off their old reputation. But it's like, what are you doing now? And that's what tonight we're gonna see what he's been doing now.